Hello everyone and welcome back to Family Life Builders TV where we're rebuilding homes and transforming society. I want to say thank you so much for joining me again on this podcast where we pray for destiny preservation for our children and for all the children all around the world. I want to say thank you so much and God bless you. Today we're going to be praying uh, from the life of a young man called Mephibosheth. Of course, this man does not emerge as a king, but of course, he's the son of a king. Mephibosheth is the grandson of the King Saul, and he is actually the, the son of Jonathan, who happens to be the friend of David, the king. Now, I want us to start this way. You see, all of us the Bible told us that we are priests, you know, and we are king unto God. According to Revelation chapter 1 verse 6, it said God has made us, he has made us a king and a priest unto God. And the Bible also told us in 1 Peter chapter 2 verse 9 that we are a royal priesthood, a holy nation. We are peculiar people. So when we look at this and we look at the situations around the world today, we we want to question some things we want to say so how come are the children misbehaving this way you know and these are the children that were born by this priest and king remember we the parents we are priest and king unto god so this means that these children were born in the temple they were born in the palace so whatever comes out of the palace when you look at the the, the queen of england and and our sons and our, and our children our grandchildren you will see this royalty you know you, you you see the aura of royalty that is emanating you know from everything about them from everything around them then you wonder those of us who are god's children who why is the children all around the world the children of god's people the children of pastors the children of leaders why are they misbehaving despite the fact that they were born in the palace but remember the the, the truth is it's because there's a battle against the seed of that woman there is a battle against those children. We need to stand up for these children. We need to cry out. Lamentations told us to cry out for our children. So tender and young. Who knows not the wrong from the right. We're going to be praying today and say, Father, my children are born in the palace. Hmm. My children are born in the palace and in the temple. I decree in the name of Jesus that they act like priests. They act like queen. They act like princes. They act like kings. They act like princesses wherever they go. In the name of Jesus. Beloved, let's open our mouth and turn it to prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, we decree and declare. You see, the Bible says in 1 Samuel chapter 2 and verse 12, is called, he referred to the sons of Eli as the sons of Belial. I want us to decree and declare. Lord, I decree and I declare. My children, they are your own. They belong to you. Oh, because I belong to you. I decree and I declare, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus, my children act like kings that you made them. They act like princes and princesses, oh God, in their conversation, in their disposition, in everywhere they go, in whatever they say, in how they drive, in how they think, in how they behave, in the name of Jesus, in what they say, in what they do even on social media, even in the secret, oh Lord, they have to, they always remember that they are kings, that they are queen, that they are queens, and they act like one in the name of Jesus. We speak concerning all the children of men and women of God all around the world. I decree and I declare in the name of Jesus that these children, oh God, they act like kings, they act like queens, they act like princes, they act like princesses in the name of Jesus, even of the Most High God, in the name of Jesus. Blessed be thy name, O God. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I want us to decree and declare just because the battle is against the seed. Remember when we were praying concerning Atalaya, remember when, when she wanted to kill all the children, she ordered them to 
kill all the royal seed. I want us to decree and declare all the royal seed that people like Ataliah, that the enemy has targeted even in for the rest of this year, oh God. Father, we cancel it. We cancel the plans of the enemy. We cancel every battle. We destroy every plans and purpose of the devil concerning our children who are royal seed all around the world. In the name of Jesus. We decree and declare that our children are secure. They are preserved. David Ogolua Fimio, you are preserved. Esther Mololua, you are preserved against every battle. Rakota Lebo Sikaya, because you are a royal seed. Rakota Liba Kirabo Shitaya, every children attached to me. All the child, all the children, all around the world, in the name of Jesus, we decree and declare every battle of the enemy against your life and your destiny. In the name of Jesus, is hereby terminated today. Every battle of sicknesses, every battle of failure, every battle of mental illness, every battle of diseases, every battle of accidents, every battle of cancer. In the name of Jesus, we command you be destroyed today. We ask that you hand today in the name of Jesus. Mase karoba shita yagadi basute lehanda. Rikota yagada bo zubrege de bo zigada yagada bo zubrege de bo. Rekete lege de bo zigada yagada bo suta lehanda bo sha. Rikoto logo do bo zubrege de bo zigada yagada bo sikata yagada bo zubrege de bo. Rakata yagada bo zubrega da ba zigada yagada bo sha. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. And our second prayer point is, um, we have like five or four prayer points under his, but it's going to be just, you know, four in one. Now, he's in Second Samuel chapter 4, verse 4. The Bible says, Jonathan, Saul's son, had a son who was lame in his feet. He was five years old when the news about Saul and Jonathan came from Jezreel. And his nurse took him up and fled. And it happened as she made haste to flee that he fell, from, he fell and became lame. His name was Mephibosheth. You see, the, 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 the nurse was trying to run. But there's a question that I keep asking. So where is the mother? Anyway, the baby fell and the baby became lame in his feet. I want us to decree and declare and hand to the still bath. And end to the death of women around the world. I want us to decree because we don't know where the mother is so we keep wondering where is the mother i want us to decree and declare in the name of jesus father in the name of jesus we pray oh god against every death death of every mother around the world in the name of jesus death of every pregnant mothers around the world death of women untimely death of women father we come against it in the name of jesus we come against the death of pregnant women Go. We come against still bats. We come against abortion in the name of Jesus. Magada yagada bosu telehanda da bosa. We decree and declare our women shall be like Hebrew women. They will carry their baby to Tam in the name of Jesus. Magada yagada bosu bregedia. Rekoto logo do bosu bregedebo. All around the world, our women will carry their baby to Tam in the name of Jesus. Magada yagada bosu telehanda da bosa. Our children. Our children, children, our generations, they will carry their baby to town. They will not cast their young in the name of Jesus. They will build and inhabit it in the name of Jesus. As mothers, oh God, we build and we inhabit it in the name of Jesus. We come against untimely death of women during pregnancy all around the world in the name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I want us to pray. I want us to decree that I will not die when my children will be laughing. Lord, we call Jesus every 
child, every mother, in the name of Jesus, <laughs> we will not die when our children will be laughing. When our children we will not understand what is going on. In the name of Jesus, we decree and declare. In the name of Jesus, we build and we inhabit it. In the name of Jesus, we will not die when our children will be laughing. In the name of Jesus, we will not die when our children will not understand what is going on. In the name of Jesus, Magada Yagada Bozu Bregedia, Rekete Legede Bozu Bregedia, with long life, you will satisfy us. In the name of Jesus, as mothers, oh God, we decree and declare in the name of Jesus. Rakota lebo sikaya, rekete lege debo zubrege debo, rege dege 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 debo sikaya gada bo zubrege dia, rakata yagada bo zubrega da bazi gada yagada bo zubrege dia, reke ke 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 bo seke debo shikata yagada bo zubrege dia, reke ke bo bo seke te lege debo zubrege debo. In the name of Jesus, long life we are satisfied with. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I want us to decree and declare. You see? The children teachers, the Sunday school teachers, the teachers in school, the influencers, the social media influencers, the celebrities, all of them are nurses. One way or the other, they are influencing our children. Because whether you like it or yes, children are on social media. So we are going to decree and declare that our children will not be destroyed. They will not become lame from the error of these influencers. Ago. They will not become lame from the mistake of these nurses in the name of Jesus. You see these people they will say some things and the children will not understand but these children accept it the way they see it. I want us to decree and declare Father in the name of Jesus my children, all our children all around the world, they will not fall into the mistakes and error of social media influencers of teachers, of Sunday school teachers of, of health workers in the name of Jesus. They shall not be a victim. David you will not be a victim. Esther you will not be a victim. All my children, all my cousins, my nieces, my nephews, all my spiritual children, all the children around the world, all the children of men and women of God around the world, we decree and declare all the children of our leaders, oh God, in the name of Jesus, they will not fall into heroes. In the name of Jesus, they will not be victim of the mistakes of, of these influencers, oh God. In the name of Jesus, you preserve our children by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, ragada yagada bo zubrege de bo zigada yagada bo sha reke ke 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 bo sikata yagada bo zubrege dia ragada yagada gada 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 bo sha reko to logo do bo zubrege dia for in Jesus mighty name we pray, Amen. And the last prayer, I want us to decree and declare, Father, cause all those who stand as nurses around the world to see that they hold destiny in their hands. I want us to decree upon them in the name of Jesus that they will do right. They will live right. In the name of Jesus, you cause intervention. In the name of Jesus, Father, we pray, we decree and declare all the nurses around the world, all the the influencers, all the celebrities, all the teachers of our children, all the Sunday school teachers, all the children teachers around the world, we pray, oh God, you will cause them to see that destinies are in their hand and you cause them to live right, oh God, in the name of Jesus, you cause righteousness to spring forth all around the world, we cry, oh God, as mothers all around the world, we decree and declare in the name of Jesus that our children they live right, they do right as a result of whatever they see in the name of Jesus I want us to quickly have this that the word of God will be established in the heart of our children so that they will not fall into error, so that they will not be, be victim of or, 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 or become lame through the people that they are looking up to you cause them to look up to Jesus as the author and the finisher of their faith in the name of Jesus even us as parents we decree and declare that we receive Receive the grace to look up to you as the author and the finisher of our faith. In the name of Jesus, we celebrate you, dear Father. Blessed be thy name, O God. We worship you, Lord. We thank you, Father. 
let's just lift up our voice and say something good to god because he has answered us this is the confidence we have in him that whenever we call upon him according to his will he, he answer and that is why we call him abba father so abba father we love you abba father we appreciate you abba father we celebrate you abba father we thank you for your faithfulness abba father we thank you because you preserve our children abba father we thank you because our children will not become lame abba father we thank you because all the nurses around the world become righteous abba father we celebrate you because our children they act and behave like prince and princes that they are blessed be thy name O god we worship you jesus we celebrate you our father we love you lord we honor you lord we praise you jesus be glorified O god for in jesus mighty name we worship and we ask with thanksgiving amen mm. i want to say thank you again for praying with me i want to appreciate you and i will see you again till i come your way again let's be keep becoming a better host because things work when we work it thank you and i'll see you next time bye for now